a thread by Marissa Hamilton to Clint L. Hickman, the chairman of the County Board of Supervisors of Maricopa County in response to his letter to the voters. Clint Hickman, you may not be aware of important key facts. My observations and research point by point in your letter. One, we have no evidence of an accurate or reliable election since Maricopa County has yet to publish any formal technical or security analysis docs re Dominion. Two, Equipment Certification Advisory Committee allowed for a Dominion-driven sales demo as their functionality test. First demo included an unknown small number of ballots. Second test was only with 16 ballots. There's no such tech reports published. Minutes, link in the thread. Three. Mandatory requirements do not include a security test. This is the top voter concern. Tech code can change, and there's no analysis or reporting published by Maricopa County on this. Arizona vote count requirements are not statistically significant and purely a ceremonial statute requirement. Four, this is wildly inaccurate. Only 2,917 election day ballots were counted. That's less than the 2% required. 2% of 167,878 election day ballots is 3,358 ballots. Second, only 5,165 early ballots were counted. 1% of 1.915 million early ballots is 19,155 ballots. Link in the thread to the report. Continued on point four, a statistically significant hand count with 99% confidence and 1% margin of error. Early ballots required 16,498. Election day ballots required 15,141. Current hand count conducted by Maricopa is ceremonial at best. Point five. The concerns highlighted by the Federal Elections Committee, Federal Elections Commission Chair, have alerted voters all across this nation regarding the security of our election. Maricopa County Board of Supervisors did not present a technical or security analysis when you conducted the $6.1 million allocation vote for Dominion. Five continued. There was no discussion by the Board of Supervisors, re other software providers you considered, no reports why Dominion was superior from a technical or security standpoint, no reports considering Texas's security concerns. Board of Supervisors did a motion, second, and a unanimous vote. From May 20th, 2019, request for a proposal. It took only 26 days to conduct the request for proposal, conduct technical analysis, negotiate the contract, and to make a vendor selection. Incredible speed with most details not shared with the public. No docs of any analysis were published after the pilot. In comparison, the city of Phoenix is currently conducting an RFP for a new election tabulation system. Notice Phoenix public record includes three vendors and a scoring system with a presentation of analysis for the city council and public with transparency. The top security concern by Texas was Dominion's open USB ports 5.5a. Texas Dominion is virtually the same software package as Arizona 5.5B. Main difference is hardware configuration. Maricopa County kept USB ports available unsealed during election. Maricopa Vote published videos showing ports open. Indeed, there is evidence of fraud. 
Tennessee voter, a Tennessee voter that left Maricopa County over a year ago to train in the Olympics somehow had a ballot released and someone harvested it, voted, the fraudulent signature approved, and ballot counted by your election department. Link in the thread to the video. Clint Hickman. I hope these additional facts enlighten you on the current situation in Maricopa County and the lack of transparency to the public with the selection, review, and process with Dominion. The trust with Maricopa County elections for many constituents is legitimately broken. When the Board of Supervisors, of which you are a chairman, Clint Hickman, approved $6.1 million dollars you said you didn't take the job to take the easy way out, and you committed to an election based on integrity. Steve Chukri, you said voting is sacrosanct, and it's your job to protect that freedom to ensure it's being done justly. Voter confidence has collapsed, with the third election cycle being called into serious question. Statute for hand count requirement by precinct is not fulfilled. Please reconsider a pause for a statistically significant hand count instead of optics, taking the easy way out, secure the vote. Thank you for your time and consideration. Maricopa County voters deserve transparency, accountability, and integrity. We must protect against future voter suppression due to a lack of trust with the elections process. Secure the vote.